You know, this next story might make you a little mad if your family drinks a lot of milk like so many families do. At the same time, milk prices are soaring. Farmers are just throwing it away. Consumer reporter John Matteris investigates so you don't waste your money. This may be one of the most outrageous things you'll ever hear. Stores are low on milk, but farmers are dumping it out. Ohio farmer Richard Conrad is doing something he's never done before, spilling out his milk tanks. Terrible, terrible. 67 years and never seen anything or did anything like this. He says milk demand is way down with schools and restaurants closed and processors don't want it. But at the same time, Cincinnati area stores have raised milk prices, have run short and now place limits on how much milk you can buy. Amy Miller of Lebanon went to order milk from Walmart for delivery and was stunned at the high price. What did the website show? $10 a gallon for 2% uh, milk and $10 a gallon for whole, whole milk. So how is it that there's a glut of milk on the farm, but not enough milk in your grocery store? Well, like a lot of things right now, it doesn't make a lot of sense. There are a lot of people who are having no paychecks right now. Linda Slusher of Milford says it's crazy. They can't haul that extra milk to stores. Why are they not diverting those goods to the grocery stores and keeping the prices down. The American Dairy Association says the problem is the milk supply lines to stores are like a funnel. There's not enough space to store and haul all that milk from farms before it spoils. Farmers like Richard Conrad hope those lines open up soon because he says spilling out milk is crazy. And then all of a sudden it's flushed down the drain. The farm group says once panic buying subsides, then prices and supply should finally level off again. So as don't waste your money. I'm John Matteries, WCPO 90s.